suing anybody over practicing our traditional ceremonies measure how deep and far our supposed religion extends. If that's what you want to call it, then surely our God is the land you occupy. So how far into unceded territory, into your schools, into your markets, into your highways and offices, there are cultural practices offend your religious freedoms. And if they offend your religious freedoms that far, while well, yours occupies just as far without having to pay taxes, then how far do our tax rates go when they are deemed a religious act? What I'm saying is be careful what you wish for. And this lawsuit is especially erroneous when our ceremony doesn't include asking for money the same way churches do. Especially when the government allows leeway for sale of stolen property to the highest bidders like origin organized religions are. And I'll ask you, in our entire lifetime, your parents' entire lifetime and your grandparents, when have we ever decided where, why, or how we exercise our cultural traditions? Never, ever, never, ever, never, ever since money decided such things. And your religion is money, is purveyor, is prayer spelled with an E. And until every church on Turtle Island gives First Nations reparations and deems their tax-free lands actual reservations for their rightful owners, and knowing there was no reconciliation for a relationship you never had, mm. I'll spray pink totals of long extinct and endangered beasts onto every cross I see. No nails, no guilt, no flames of war against diversity, no conquest of worlds you haven't enough knowledge of to claim any capacity to tend to or pretend to provide the promise of redemption. The promise of a world you can't prove even exists while destroying the one that very well does. And they leverage your soul with crimes you've never committed while the most recent genocidal crusade was led by them through Turtle Island, facilitated and perpetuated by all occupying governments. So I'll ask you once now, who do we sue? And I'll ask you again, how far into unceded territory, into your schools, into your malls, into your highways, and projected pipeline paths does our cultural practice offend your freedoms? And is it as deep as you drilled into the earth and ecosystems of our mother earth? Is it as wide as our welcoming arms when you first arrived? And I want to see no crosses, no crosses and no crosses on Turtle Island. Only wings and an appeal to your love for Mother Nature and all of her children. For they are our brothers and sisters and siblings. Sue that. <laughs>